I'm Michael Fisher, the Golden Plains Area Livestock Extension. Today I'd like to visit with you for a moment or two about body condition scoring your cow. This is a management tool that we can use on any herd. You can do it at home, do it yourself. It doesn't cost you anything other than a little bit of observational time. We score our cows, uh, body condition score our cows on a system based on one to nine. One being a very emaciated animal, nine being extremely fat. We like to see those cows in about a five condition score. Uh, and it's very easy to do. You can get uh, tables and graphs, pictures, whatnot, to be able to show you those different uh, body condition scores. One of the uh, advantages to being able to body condition score your cows is that it gives you an idea of where your cows are on a nutritional plane. Do you need to be feeding them a little bit more? Do we, are we feeding them too much and it's costing us some money? Uh, and it gives us a good idea of where the herd on a whole is on that nutritional plane. So, if you want to body condition score your cows, where might you look to uh, see if uh, you're in the right stage of the game? Well, I like to do it in a systematic approach. I'll look along the cow's back line, see how much fat she has put in uh, going down along the spine, or if there's a lot of spine sticking up. After I've looked at the back line, I'll go down along the ribs, see how much of the ribs are showing, if any, or if they're all showing. I like to get into the pawns back here around the tail head and see what kind of fat conditions we have in that area as well as uh, looking in the breast and seeing how much fat is built up in around the breast. Uh, as I said, I like to have my cows in a body condition of four or five. It gives us the opportunity to have about the best reproductive uh, comeback of what we're going to get. Uh, research has shown that uh, if we have a cows in a body condition of four or three or lower, it starts taking longer for those cows to come back in heat after they calve. Also, uh, we have shown that uh, those cows with lower body condition scores also do not produce as much immunoglobulins in their milk as what the cows in a five or a six do. And what does that say? Well, when the calf gets that first colostrum, there's not as many antibodies in there that's going to protect that calf. So if we've got a body condition score of five or six cow, there's a better chance for those calves to come out healthy. Um, now, if we start getting into the eight or nine, then we can have problems with fat around the reproductive systems of the cows, and they won't breed back. Uh, also, you're just having a lot of waste there that you're losing value and feed your feed. So we try to get in that body condition score of five or six and uh, have an optimal uh, nutritional plane there. If you have further questions about this or want to discuss it more or even want to uh, be able to sit down and talk about the different degrees of the, the different various body condition scores and what to look for, I'd be happy to visit with you. You can reach me at the Yuma County Extension Office in Green, Colorado at 970-332-4151. Thank you and you have a good day.